in this video, we're going to walk you through step by step how to assemble and mount your solar arch onto your boat. But first, let's take a look at some of the tools you're going to need for the installation. Welcome to Baltic Solar Arches. Before we get started assembling the arch, let's take a look at the assembly parts that came with your arch and some additional tools you're going to need. Small bolts for putting the arch together, some larger bolts for fastening your arch to the deck, some backing plates that goes underneath the deck. You're gonna need two Allen keys, one four millimeter, one five millimeter, pencil, some marine grade sealant, a nine millimeter drill, and a spade bit for drilling a larger hole to get the cables down through the deck. Step one is putting the arch together. And for that, we're going to use 32 of these small bolts. We're going to use marine grade loop, and we're going to use a four millimeter Allen key. The arch itself consists of eight pieces. We have the port side. We have two connector pieces, stainless steel also. We have two middle pipes. Over here, we have again two connector pieces. And then we have, of course, the starboard side over here. Assembling the solar arch is super simple. You take your bolts, apply a little bit of the loop, take your connector pieces, insert them here, and put in the bolt. Now when we're putting the arch together, we just want to lightly tighten the bolts. Once we get the arch onto the bolt, we're gonna loosen them again to make sure the arch sets properly on the boat and then we're gonna tighten them finally. So the first time around, be careful not to over, over tighten the bolts. There we go, that's one, 31 to go. Now with the arch assembled, it's time to move to the boat. We have placed the arch with the davits pointing downwards so that it's now ready to go onto the boat. We have pulled the boat close towards the dock so that it lies as steady as possible while we're mounting the arch. And right now we're attaching the main halyard to the top of the arch to prevent the arch from tipping backwards once we get it onto the boat. I have now loosened all the bolts just a quarter of a turn. I have checked that all the four feet are in the exact right position. And now I'm going to mark on all of the four feet where we're going to drill the holes down through the deck. Now comes the part that every sailor hates, drilling holes in the boat. And to protect the environment as much as possible, we are going to use a vacuum cleaner while drilling.
from the top of the arch, we're going to lead the solar panel cables down through this forward leg. And I'm going to use now this backing plate, which is normally goes under the deck. I'm just gonna use it now to mark where the center of the foot is going to be on the deck. As a final check, we insert all the bolts just to check that they properly go into the holes. Before making the final placement of the arch down onto the deck and bolting it down, we're going to apply some marine grade sealant on the deck, uh, just along the edge of the foot. All their feet are now in the positions. There's sealant underneath, bolts going through. Now underneath the deck, you're gonna put backing plates. So here's the deck, bolt going through, backing plate, a washer, and finally the nut. Now I'm taking my four millimeter Allen key again, and I'm going to tighten all the assembly bolts in the arch as the final step. And that's it. Now the arch is fully installed on the boat. Congratulations on your new solar arch. Watch our other video for how to install solar panels onto your arch. Should you have any questions or feedback, we would love to hear from you. You can find our contact information on our website, balticsolararches.com.